If you ask a stranger if they've heard of War of Rights, they'll probably say something like... <laughs> I've definitely seen some less than politically friendly. Is that the f***ing game of the Confederacy shit where all the, the, the Proud Boys play? Yeah, I mean, if you like good old boys in the hard R, you'd love the game. I have only played it once. And that one time you played, what did you experience? And with all that being said, I decided that I'd try it out for myself and see if what they're saying is true or if it's just a few wild players overshadowing an actually good game. Hello, fellas. Holy sh look at all this coordination. Oh, sh holy sh Oh, my gun's not loaded. Piece of sh we just did the good. I've played this game before, but each time seems like its own experience. And I've only been in this match for like five minutes and it's just like organized chaos. And the players seem to all be in character. Oh, I missed, I missed, ah. Well, that did not go well. I'm actually lost. I have no clue where my captain is. I don't see the star. Oh, there he is. Thank you, sir. Thank you for the, your service. I'm just following orders. I'm just following orders. I'm just following orders. It's nothing personal. Hey, great work back there, fellas. Oh, sh I miss on all the fun. Once I died, I figured it'd be a good time for me to try and go one on one with some of these other players. Hey, soldier. Scott Av. Scott Avel Eno Jr. So you're named after your father? I'm sure he's a great guy. Don't stop, don't stop, shove it in them. Harder, harder. Pizza, pizza. Ah, oh, I'm, I was on your team. Did we win? I think we won. Hell yeah, baby. I mean, and would not even that many guys died. That first game was honestly great, and if you know me, you know that I love a game where everyone's using their mic. And so far, I hadn't run into like any majorly controversial players. But then again, I've only been on the north side. I'm sure later when I join the south side, it might be a different story. But for now, everyone was really helpful, and they would answer any questions I had. Hey, Captain. What's up? So how can I avoid keep getting stabbed by my my pals? Oh, it's probably because they're not spamming T. That's why you should always uh, say it when you push him. But how uh, spam T for no What I would recommend is that you Okay, find a battle. All right, I I gotta find a battle buddy. Anyone want to be my battle buddy? This guy, Riles. Riles, I'm following you. Where is he? You guys all look the same. Look out to your right. I just saved your life, partner. Piece of sh. Oh wait, was that a friendly? Oh, oh no. We gotta stick together. Oh, I'm oh. oh no! My battle buddy. Riles is dead. Oh. We are horrible battle buddies. Yeah, it's not working out. Flags, flags, hide the wagon, hide the wagon, right here. We should go our separate ways. Yeah, it's not me, it's you. Well, at least this time I didn't die to friendly fire. So I spawned back at the main camp, and I was met by a player that was telling me about, um, well, I'm not really sure. 
I got married to a young Pennsylvania gal. Right. Really liked the king back in England. Congressional Army, the Continental Congress, they passed me up for promotion. No, I, I, the I won the day many times for the United States of America. I, I mean, I had a couple bad business dealings and, you know, a few too many rowdy parties and shit. But, but I, I, I'm a businessman. I tried to make money. Things didn't go well. I spent a lot of my personal wealth into the Continental Army. Should we, should we, go, should we go kill some rebels or something? All right, let's go. So the union's not too bad, huh? I honestly haven't heard any uh, racial slurs, which kind of surprised me. But I guess that's more if you join the South. Well, yeah, we just gotta shoot the racism out of these boys. Here we go. Ah, I'm wounded pretty bad. Howdy. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir, sorry. Sorry to disappoint. Come on, guys, get in the line. He's our superior. This kid somehow became our leader, and everyone was listening to him for the most part. And I just gotta say, it's nice to see the youth take interest in such a historically driven game. <laughs> Poor kid. You all right, sir? Maybe they just. Hey! Hey! Break it up! Break it up! Break it up! Final push. Too bad that captain won't be here to see it. I kind of thought they were on my team. <laughs> Alright, with the first few games out of the way, I gotta admit I was actually having a lot of fun and I was definitely staying entertained. But it's time to call it for the night, and I planned on playing in the morning, but it just didn't have the same feeling to it. Now I got some time to reload my musket. How you boys doing? So I waited till night time, and I joined again. What? I can't hear you, it's too loud! Speak up! What? Can you hear me now? Yeah, is it working? Hello! Hello! Test, test, testing! Hey, Milk Dud Nips, can you hear me? Yep. Okay. Now that Milk Dud Nips confirmed that my mic was working, I figured it was time. So I joined the South, and well, the strangers from the intro were not lying, and a bit of this had to be cut out due to uh, historical accuracy. Howdy, fellas. I switched teams. No, no, I switched. I wanted to see what this was all about. Uh, no, uh, no, 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 no. Now, if you've ever played War of Rights, you know there's one thing that the North and the South agree on, and that's getting people to join their regiment. And it didn't take long for the invites to start rolling in. You want to join the regiment? You want to join the regiment? Yeah, you should join the Israel Alabama. Our Lord and Savior, King nah, you should join first SCOR. Us, would you be interested in joining South Carolina, the right side of the war? No, I'm thinking. Have you ever considered joining the regiment? Um, I've considered it once, but um, you know, I just, you know, life throws a lot of curveballs at you, and you don't, you know, know how to hit them right. Yeah, I heard it's a lot of fun. 
It's certainly a thing. Let's get to the left. Okay, sir. Now, if, if, you, if you ever change your mind, uh, there's a certain... What's all the yelling about? Huh? No. Can you guys hear me? I got him, boys. Did you see me stab that guy back there? Oh. Ah! Ah! I got stabbed in the abdomen. Are they gonna have to amputate me? I think I'm slowly fading away. I'm dead. What are we yelling about? I could tell these players were super passionate about this game, but sometimes they'd say or do things that would confuse me. Hey, little boy, let's go tear some Yankee ass. Uh, do what? Let's go tear some Yankee ass. Um, I think we have de different definitions of that. We just met. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing down there? What the hell? I'm not joining your regiment, no matter what you do. <laughs> Even after playing multiple rounds of this game, I really still have no clue what, like, what's going on, how it even works. Like, who's winning, who's losing, I don't know. But apparently, I got this feeling that we're doing bad. Long to get on the point. You can guys have been up there digging around, sucking each other's. Like uh, the you are. We're trying our best. Yeah, your name is misleading, bro. Good vibes. I think we're safe in here. We kind of blend in. Holy shit, they're right here. They came out of nowhere. I think we lost. No, wait, we won. No way, we lost. Did we? I think we won. All right. I mean, good for me, not good for history. To my surprise, we actually won that, so I decided, well, I won one with you guys. I guess I'll do another. Howdy. Wait, what? Holy shit, it's you, Riles. You switch sides? Yeah, I mean, I came down to the south, and it is a different type of uh, chaos down here. Let's hit him where it hurts, am I right? I killed their captain. Shoot him. Don't let him get away. You got it. Uh, he was unarmed and running away from us, but you know. Well, we might have just invented it. Keep shooting, boys. Keep shooting. So, anyways, I just ran in there with my bayonet down and started stabbing anything that moved. We almost won. Hell yeah! Oh. Alright, so I gotta be honest. Playing War of Rights was one of the most entertaining times I've had on a game in a while. Everyone's talking, working together, and it's got some of the most dedicated players that I've run into in any game. And yeah, once in a while you'll hear some wild stuff that you'd hear in, you know, an old Call of Duty lobby. But most of the time it's just this niche group of players enjoying their favorite game. So I guess what I'm trying to say is... Have you ever considered joining a regiment? 